Yeah, yeah. Tell them they can tune in, show you how we do this. I put all love on a billboard. So you just need to look out your window. Shut up. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Keita. If you are new here or if you're an OG, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on to be notified every time I upload a video so you don't miss out on a delicious meal. Today, y'all, we will be cooking um, stuffed taco shells. This meal is very budget friendly and it is healthy because I'm using ground turkey. So if you are interested, make sure your hands are impeccably clean. You will need ground turkey or any meat that you choose. Taco seasoning. I actually have two just in case. Sour cream. Some queso blanco. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong, y'all, but I actually had two cans. Just to be sure, I have some lari seasoning. Some on the border salsa. Some jumbo shells three-fourths cups of water, parsley flakes to garnish, you don't have to, garlic powder, and black oh, yeah. pepper. Okay, y'all, to a hot skillet, I've added my ground turkey, and I'm gonna season it. Being that it's ground turkey, I would heavily season. So I have um, garlic powder. I'm gonna add a little bit of the lari seasoning. And I'm gonna add some like and I'm gonna also add a bit of the taco seasoning. This is really good. I'm gonna mix this and then I'm gonna add some more seasoning, y'all. Add some more garlic powder. Black pepper. Okay, y'all. So now my meat is cooking, and I'm just chopping it up and letting it cook all the way. I'm gonna finish letting it cook, and then I'll drain it. Also, make sure you guys are tasting your meat as you go, so it's like how you like it. So now I have drained off my meat. I'm gonna add a little salsa. The three four cups of water. And the rest of the taco seasoning. Actually gonna add just a little bit more taco seasoning from the other packet. Make sure y'all season this hot until you like it. So just to show y'all, put the lid on it for a few minutes and just let it marry each other. I'm just showing y'all what it's looking like so far. So I'm gonna finish letting it simmer down a little bit and then I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so I'll let this cook down a little bit. So this is what we are looking like. And it is definitely done, and it smells so, so, so good. I could let this go for just like a few more minutes, but I could let it go for a few more minutes, but this is actually good enough. So I'm gonna stuff my shells and then I'll be back. You guys, I'm so sorry. I actually wanted to apologize. At this moment, I didn't really realize that I was recording, but I am stuffing my shells. Before I stuffed my shells, I did add the rest of the sauce at the bottom of the pan, and then I stuffed them. So now y'all, I'm just adding the cheese. So 
now that I've added the cheese, I'm gonna put it in the oven on 350 until the cheese melts. Okay, y'all, so this is what it looks like after I've let the cheese melt a little and I put some parsley flakes on here to garnish. Okay, you guys, so I did add like a couple spoonfuls of sour cream, so we're gonna taste. So I'm getting some of the shell and sour cream. Oh my God. Y'all, this is so good. I hope you guys enjoy this meal. She made it, but I'll tell y'all if it's good or not. <laughs> <laughs> that's my mama y'all so tell me down below in the comments if you like the meal please enjoy and